Good morning. Welcome back. I hope everyone had a restful weekend and spent some time outside. It was some beautiful weather. <clears throat> I hope you got a lot of things done. And now we're back for a four-day week. So it is Tuesday now. We have Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday for school. So let's start by doing a balloon breath. Take that one off. Get ready to fill your balloons. Take a big deep breath. Five, four, three, two, one. Pop it. Let's do it again. Fill your balloon. Five, four, three, two, one. Pop it. And one more time. Fill up the biggest one. Five, four, three, two, one. Pop it. Awesome. All right, now let's say good morning to our friends. Good morning, Zara. Zara celebrated a special holiday this weekend. You looked so beautiful in your dress. I loved seeing those pictures. Thank you for sharing that. Good morning, Isabella. Good morning, Nora. Good morning, John. Good morning, Lucas Acosta. Good morning, Cristani. Good morning, Ava. Good morning, Emmy. Good morning, Ariana. Good morning, Nolan Morales. Good morning, Sari. Good morning, James. Good morning, Dream. Good morning, Lucas Hall. Good morning, Nolan Germain. Hope you had a fun birthday weekend. Good morning, Olivia. Good morning, Lucy. And good morning, Conrad. So I said good morning to all of the students in our class today. Hope you're having a wonderful day. All right, this week is our last week of studying insects. I know last week we kind of went in a different direction, um, but we're gonna finish things up this week and we're gonna talk about what bugs or insects are in our community and how do they help our community. So we'll talk a little bit more about that over the week and then we'll be done with our insect study. Can you believe it? And then we'll be focusing on kindergarten because you guys are getting ready. All right, so our letter this week is the first letter of the alphabet. If you think you know what letter that is, what is it? Can you whisper it in my ear? That's right, the letter A is the first letter in the alphabet. Now, is this an uppercase or a lowercase A? This is an uppercase, just like our friend Ava has an A in her name. Her first letter of her name is an A, and it is uppercase. And then on the other side of the uppercase A, is this an uppercase or a lowercase? A lowercase A. Now this one kind of looks a little bit different, and I'm going to show you another A that's lowercase. Is at the end of Ava's name is an, a lowercase a. So sometimes lowercase a looks like this. It's a little bit more fancy. And then there's some a's that look like this. But they're both the same letter. They're both a. So I wanted to show you Ava's name because she has both in her name. An uppercase and a lowercase. So now that we know the letter of the week, can you guess what our sight word is going to be? It starts with the letter a and it's two letters long. It's a very short word. It is the letter, I mean the word, at. At, A-T. So you can actually sound this word out. At, at, t, at. Awesome. So this is what we'll be talking about this week. This is the letter we'll be talking about this week. We're also gonna be finishing up our insect study. So before we leave for the day, your challenge is 
Can you come up with a list of words that begin with the letter A? We didn't have a very large list last week, but maybe we'll have a big one this week. So send those in. We'll make a list together as a classroom, and we'll talk about them tomorrow. I believe in you. All right, my friends. Have a great day. We will see you on Zoom again this week. We'll see some of you today. Have a good day.